And how's it going? Head off here, bringing you a brand new video, and I'm going to be doing a review on Rugby League Life 3 and telling you guys whether or not you should get it or not. But yeah, these are all the little hub things you can click on, but I'll get into depth more, but we'll get into casual now. Um, this is my most recently played game versus V Broncos. I played that with one of my mates. Um, but yeah, you can play mystery matches, and that sets everything up for you, and you don't have to do anything, you just get straight into the game. But yeah, an Auckland Nines, State of Origin, um, I'm pretty sure you can play City Country, all that, but yeah, here are all the teams. Um, you can even play, yeah, the, uh, the Super League, and then the Intra Super Cup, and just the regular, but you can also play as the developers as well. See, True Blue Games, True Blue Games, Big Ant Studios, just have a bit of bit of banter with the mates. But yeah, here we are, Grand Final, NRL match, yep. Well, that, that's all your games you can play, so, too easy. Online match, this is just, yeah, all typical online matches, you can play with your friends, play tournaments, get your rankings up on the leaderboards and all that, all that fun, but, uh, yeah. Nothing too special. But yeah, so that's online. And we'll get into another one. We'll get into drills. Alright, so here's goal kicking. Goal kicking is pretty tough, so you want to have to practice. So you have to get into the practice arena. You can practice your sideline kicks. Just just straight in front ones. It's passing drill. Passing drill is pretty straightforward as well. Um, just... You know, it's just basic stuff you got to get down pat, but we'll get into a passing drill and show you how it is. And I'll get back to goal kicking in a sec. So here's the training arena. It comes up with some instructions. Just skip that or you can read it, but it just tells you the logistics of the drill. Um, it's pretty straightforward. So what you want to do here is get through the gap and then pop it to the man on the side here. Do the same again, pop it to the right, run forward a bit, and pop it to the right again. L1 and R1 are the ones to click to pass, so if you want to pass left, you press L1, if you want to pass right, R1, pretty straightforward. But yeah, Preview. this is pretty much it, up and down the field. I think I stuffed up that one, but who cares, it's just a tutorial. It's not the actual game, dudes, come on. But yeah, failed that one. Get into another drill. Alright, so here's the goal kicking drill. We'll get into this one. Pretty straightforward. I'm with Roger Tuovashashek. He's my drill player, so let's do this. So here we are, back at the training arena. Place kicking. This is what I said before. Um, this game is pretty weird with the kicking. And um, especially from out wide, if you got to compensate for the wind but don't overcompensate it's easy to do that um, but yeah the straightforward ones pretty easy preview yeah you can curve it in the air with your um your right right stick but yeah we'll just do one more just to get it down pat so you know what's going on yep you could left right up down get the height preview smash it up in the area Bang. but yeah you want to get it to the top the top of the green and that gets you power if you go down the red obviously you get to get into another drill okay tackling drill I've done this one before because I needed to work on it but um, it's pretty straightforward like the other ones just simple ball and all tackles leg tackles and you can do the big hit which I love but uh, without further ado let's get into this training ground again we've got the instructions yep tackling instructions yeah this is the man that's gonna be running the ball at us God help him all right so it's just gonna slow mow it down when you get close because you want to get it close enough see that was pretty bad but you want to get it close to um that little white line and that gets you perfect tackle Really roll them over in the on the ground, slow it down heaps. Um, you can do this for all of them. Get your points up, and then you go on the leaderboards. 
JT there smashing him. But where is he? 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 But yeah, you can you can tell when it's a perfect tackle because it starts to glow. And sh well, it doesn't shake, but it just glows. The little bar glows. As well, you got stamina, stamina, and your little red one on the other side. That's your stamina. But yeah, we'll end this drill and we'll get into another one. All right, the final drill, the playmaker drill. All right, so this drill is just your in-game kicking. So you rubbers, you big kicks downtown big bombs and you can also do field goals here but I don't think it's in this drill but yeah just stuff up there and to get to the playmaker just double press R1 and L1 at the same time but I just did that then Preview. that was a terrible grubber you want to get it in that highlighted zone so I'll do it here the lines with the beautiful grubber let's do this very nice very nice and he runs out Okay, so this is the big downtown kick. We'll go long here. Questionable for each one. Kick. But yeah, you get points for each one. And this is the bomb. Just keep on doing them to get higher on the leaderboards, just like the tackling. But yeah, we'll get in. But yeah, I'll show you some other options in the game. Preview. Alright, so yeah. That drill play there is just um, to pick what play you want to do all your stuff with, all your drills with, so pretty straightforward. I was with uh, one or two of us, check there. Alright, so, career. I'm doing a uh, career mode at the moment with one or two of us, check, so that's already a professional player, but you can also do a rookie player as well as a coach player. Uh, not a coach player, as well as a coach. You can lead your team to victory, coaching, same with rookie get the salary your salary cap up and spend all money on stuff I haven't I haven't really looked into it but um yeah I'm currently doing the pro player to a last check with the roosters uh, yep load and delete your players so you can begin new careers but yeah all right so the next one would be competition I'm also doing a competition a series with the roosters and um yeah so start with your Telstra Premiership, Super League, you can do an Auckland 9 series, State of Origin series, and you can do a custom comp, where you can combine all those into one, so that's, that would be pretty pretty cool, let me know if you want me to do one of those series, I could easily do one for you, but yeah, they're all fun to do, try them out once you get the game, because I do approve of this, alright, so the Fan Hub, the Fan Hub is where you can create your players, Oh, you can create custom players, sorry, um, as well as the list of official 2015 players. You can edit your player, delete your player. You can edit and create clubs, or you can make your own club from different teams, like different players and that. Get your coaches in, referees, we don't like them, but we can make them. So we'll just scrap that, we don't want to talk about them, they're bastards, aren't they? Uh, league. And community. The community is what we want. So it says Corey Parker here, but this is all the um, versions of Corey Parker people have made of. So, so you can see here a lot of people have made Corey Parker, and you can rate them with stars. Uh, this one's number. Four. He's got four star rating. This guy's got four star rating. I reckon he's pretty close. He's not wrong. He's even got the strapping down tat, down pat with the tattoos as well. But yeah, um, hot clubs, roosters players. You know what? You can check out all this stuff. It doesn't really coincide with the game too much. You can we'll have a look at it anyway. Um, but yeah, you can search up community people. You can search the community and see what people have made. That's basically what this is for. Um, check out people's teams and that. So, and settings. You can change all your settings. Just general stuff. All right, dudes. So I'm going to show you how in-game looks. I reckon it looks pretty nice. The graphics are beautiful. The grass is nice and lush and green. When it rains, it rains, and you can tell because the jerseys get all dirty and all that. But I'll let you guys watch and see what you think. And um, I'll meet you at the end of the video.
Bosses. My friends, and fantastic to have you with us as we bring you coverage of today's clash between the Sydney Roosters and the Brisbane Broncos. Andrew Voss here, and I have the pleasure of welcoming a man that has coached two sides to Premiership glory, Mr. Phil Gould. G'day, Gus. Couldn't have asked for a better day, really. A dry park, not a lot of wind, and a good crowd building up. Both teams are going to enjoy soaking up this atmosphere. I'm expecting to see some exciting football play from both sides. Well, judging by the traffic getting into the game, of course, you get the helicopter to the ground, Gus, but there was roads blocked everywhere. Big crowd for what is quite the game. Harker, Glenn. I do recommend this game, guys. You should go and get it. It's a great time. Yeah, that's mostly it. Um, if you liked the video, guys, drop a like got any suggestions for me leave it in the comment section below uh, subscribe as well um, and as always and I'll see ya see you dudes